Hi, my name is Ricardo Charlson with Galati Yacht Sales and today we're on board this 2015 Viking 75 motor yacht. Yacht Not Guilty has four staterooms and two crew cabins and comes fully equipped. She has all the nice upgrades. She has the Sea Keeper 16, the larger Caterpillar C32, so 1925 horsepower engines. It's still under Caterpillar Platinum warranty until May of 2023. The boat has all the upgraded flooring, the electric blinds. The boat also has dual custom-made dehumidifiers that sits in the bilge to control the humidity level inside the boat at all times. All servers are up to date and including bottom job. This boat is truly turnkey and ready to go. Starting here in the cockpit, we have a very large seating arrangement, big table. We also have an upgraded system, which is air conditioning through your backrest. And on the port side here, we have the door that opens through the gunnel with the optional boarding ladder, very nice feature. And here on the starboard side, we have the stairs leading up to the flybridge. Here on the flybridge aft deck, you can have uh, chairs to sunbathe in. You also have a sink. You have a nice grill up here and an ice maker. As we're moving up here towards the bow, on the starboard side we have our side door and right outside of it, this gunnel opens up as well. So if you're side two and you have a nice height on the dock, you can step right on the dock, very convenient. Here in the bow, we have a very nice pop-up lights here on both starboard and port side. We also have a tow light that goes underneath the entire vessel and that can be customized any color, same as you can do with your underwater lights. Uh, on top of the lights here, we also have a receiver right here for four carbon fiber poles with a sunshade. So when you're sitting at you know, the sandbar or in the Bahamas, wherever you may be, you can be here in shade. And we also have a very large seating arrangement, runs port to starboard. Big sun pad with tons of storage. Right in here is a nice cooler, so you can be soft drinks, alcohol, whatever it may be. You have easy access to it. You don't have to walk all the way back into the galley or the salon. We have great storage on these wings, port and starboard as well. And as you're walking forward, you'll notice there's no ground tackle. Everything is underneath the deck, so nothing to hit your toes on or it'll get in your way when you walk in here. It's right under here. It's perfect. As we're stepping into the salon here, you'll see on the port side here, we have a large sitting arrangements. There's actually a dining table that will go right here that we have in storage right now. So we have more seating, but of course that can be put back on. Uh, on the starboard side, we have a TV that pops up right behind this love seat. And we have our stairs leading up to the flybridge. Moving forward here in the salon, we have our starboard side entry door. And we have a day head just forward of that. I also want to mention uh, all these flooring is all upgraded hardwood flooring. There's no Amtico, same on the bridge. Uh, we also have all electric motorized blinds around here, uh, also up in the forward, which we will see. As we're stepping into the galley, we've got full-size Viking appliances. We've got an espresso machine here in the galley. Uh, also motorized blinds up here. There's a pop-up TV and a large sitting arrangement on both port and starboard side. As you're walking up to the flybridge, you'll notice that it's fully enclosed and fully air conditioned. And we also have a large sunroof and upgraded hardwood flooring. Up here on the flybridge, we have a very large seating arrangement. We have fully air conditioning. We have our optional sunroof, pop-up TV, refrigeration, and of course, a very large sliding door aft. Being up here while you're underway doing 33 knots, it's completely silent. It's peaceful, you have your air conditioning. So being in the Bahamas or Florida, wherever it may be, you're sitting here and it's very comfortable and you can have a normal conversation, no wind in your face, and you can be here all day long. So under all these sofas, down in the salon and up here on the bridge, there's tons of storage and it's very easy to access. You simply lift this up and it's on a gas strut. It's a great access. Up here on the bridge, you will see we have tons of seating facing forward. We have a large double seat over here, captain's helm seat, and another large double seat right over here. They also have tons of storage underneath, which is great. 
And uh, now to the fun stuff. This boat has both Furuno and Garmin system. So if you don't like Garmin, if you don't like Furuno, you have both. And one acts as a backup. Uh, we of course have our Cat 360. This boat comes with the upgraded Caterpillar C32s. They're 1925 horsepower each. And they will push this boat to about 33 knots wide open. So the boat has Cat 360, which is a joystick. It operates with an upgraded, it's a very large bow thruster. And of course you have a separate control for the thruster. This boat also has, similar to Skyhook, it's called Cat360 Hold. You push a button and you will stay put when you're waiting for a bridge or whatever it may be. Uh, we also have our FLIR camera right here, which is tied into the monitors. Uh, the boat also has a gyro, the Sea Keeper 16, to keep it very stable at rough seas. Um, we can also uh, show you we have all the cameras here tied into various points on the boat. This boat also has upgraded camera system throughout the salon, the flyer bridge, the galley, aft deck, for example, and that is all uh, controlled via a touch phone or a tablet, and you can control and see that from anywhere in the world. So you have great visibility on that. The boat has its famous ETA system. This controls all the systems on the boat, pumps, lights, everything is controlled from these touch panels. So this Viking 75 has uh, four staterooms and two crew, and as we're walking down to the lower cabins, we'll show you that as well. So this is the forward VIP with a large queen-size bed. This opens up to a lot of storage. We've got nice, beautiful windows here in the bow and also overhead, and your head is right on the port side. And if we walk back a little bit, right in here, we have a full-size washer dryer, right in here. Here in the master, on the starboard side, we do have a nice sitting area, like a desk or a makeup station. Uh, we have a big TV with a sound bar. We also have the additional dehumidifier in here to keep it really nice with no, no humidity. Uh, port side, we have our love seat right here with these very large windows on both starboard and port side. And as we're stepping back, we have a very big head with two sinks and a very large shower. And now we're in the port VIP and we have a large shower and the head is forward and a large size bed. And also underneath the bed, we have tons of storage. And this boat also has two large dehumidifiers. They're custom installed, they run through the bilge and keeps the boat really nice and dry. So no humidity inside the vessel. Now we're on the starboard VIP and we have twin beds right in here and we have the head aft. And this boat has tons of storage and there's not one spot on the boat that is not utilized. There's storage right here, great for towels or linens or whatnot. Back here in the transom area, we have a hydraulic swim platform. As you can see, it will house a very large tender and it's great for if you go swimming, you're dropping down to water level and it's easy to get in and out of the water. And also this is where we enter the crew cabin. Now we're in the crew quarters in the aft of the boat and on the starboard side we have the captain's corner, it's a larger bed. And then we have the ability to sleep two more crew on the port side. And our head is right inside this door right here. And we have a little bit of cooking capabilities. We have a convection microwave oven. We have a fridge in here as well. And also this is where we have another one of these ETA screens that controls the entire vessel. Now we're in the engine room and these are the Caterpillar C32s and they're 1925 horsepower each. We also have right behind you here, we have dual 32KW generators. And we also have a nice Spectra water maker in here that we added. And as you can see above the fuel tanks here, we have some custom painted toolboxes. All the bilge is nice and clean. Everything is painted white, including the seacocks. Thank you for joining us on this 2015 Viking 75 motor yacht. For more information, feel free to reach out to myself or visit galatiyachts.com.